Hi, we're here at Rockin' River Fest with Kylene Shannon and a couple of her bandmates, Twyla and Paul. So last year you won the talent contest yes. uh, that we saw last night. And what did that entail um, for you last year? Um, well, last year I went up there and uh, and after the contest uh, winning, I got to open up for Sam Hunt. And then we also got the opportunity to record your own single. So I did that as well. Yeah. Did you actually get to meet Sam? <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? Yeah. <laughs> That's a secret. Yeah, no, you can you get uh, backstage passes, so you have the opportunity to meet the artists. Very cool. Which we have tonight as well. That's very cool. Mm -hmm. So what has happened uh, since last year up until you're here this year? Well, we spent most of the year working on the single. Um, I've been with my band for a couple of years, but we're, we're going to be performing it tonight live. So we spent most of the year getting the single all ready and everything, creating the music behind it and recording the vocals. Mm -hmm. And how long have you been with your band? About three, four years now. Yeah, four years. And they're excited to be here, right, Paul? You betcha. <laughs> yeah, very excited. Yeah. I hear this is your first big stage. Is oh, yeah, I'm just, I'm on the coattails of Kylene big time. Yeah, it's, <laughs> uh, it's, qu it's quite surreal, actually. We, when we met Kylene, um, she, she was singing karaoke, and, but she was an awesome singer and probably didn't know how awesome she was. So we're just very happy to have found her and to be able to play with her for the last few years. Um, so I can't say enough about her singing. It's, it's awesome. She's got a very powerful, powerful voice, which you can't find just anywhere. So, uh, but yeah, and I'm just, I'm just the mediocre bass player that plugs lawn in the background. I, you know, I just, uh, I like, I lurk in the shadows. That's what I do. Yeah. That's the way I like it. So, yeah. <laughs> Sounds good. So what, um, musical, um, influences have you had over the last few years? Um, I have a variety of influences, but for... As far as like the single goes, it's really like Gretchen Wilson, anything with attitude, you know, and that's power vocals, that's kind of my go-to and what I enjoy the most. So this, you know, obviously is quite a huge beginning for you. Where do you see yourself in the next four or five years? Well, we'll see how many downloads I get off of iTunes, so, <laughs> and then we'll go from there. No, yeah, no, I could see myself possibly recording an album now that I've been through the process. And uh, hopefully we, are, me and the band, get to uh, come back to Rock and River. I would a absolutely love that, and I know they would too. And is there any venue or artist you would just dream of opening for? You know, I think one of the one of the powerhouse country women like Gretchen Wilson, for example, that would be killer, or Carrie Underwood, or something like that. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. So, what can we expect from your uh, show tonight? You can expect to have a lot of fun. I'm going to work that stage and hopefully people get out of the river in time because we're on pretty early. And uh, yeah, you'll have a lot of fun if they come out. Well, sounds good. I'm looking forward to your show tonight. And thank you for this interview. Thank you. Awesome.